In this video, we do a champion's breakdown with a leader's spin. What's up, gang? Let's go swing online. Miss Megan here and... Brian B. And we are bringing you a champion's breakdown. This is Ben Morris and Melissa Roots. And this is a leader's spin. And uh, Megan was the one who pulled this out of the archives. And it's actually something I do all the time. Unlike all of the other cool moves that Ben Morris does, it looks like this. One, two, we do two spins and a ronde, and then we come out of it. Or you can do six if you want, or eight, or 10, or 12. So we do it one more time from the other side. Boom, boom, we do a couple of spins, a little ronde, and off we go. So here's how this is gonna work. I'm gonna do this from this side. So what I'm doing is I'm leading a um, one, two of a whip and catching this hand to stop Megan. And then I'm gonna use this to work off of. And there's some spin things that we're gonna talk about and some resources, but let's just talk about the pattern first, then we'll talk about how to improve the spin. So we go seven, eight, or actually one, two of a whip to catch that like palm to palm connection. And from here, I'm gonna step in a position that's comfortable for me to then flare this leg to create some energy for the spin. Cool, if we do it from the other side. This is the setup. I wanna get used to doing that position there. I wanna do it a couple times, boom, because there's a momentum thing that's going on where I have to stop Miss Megan there. And then from this position, I'm gonna get myself up and onto this foot, flare my right leg, do two spins, Ben does a ronde off of it, and then we're gonna walk, walk to create a little bit of an away connection for an anchor. So let's talk about the leader's part of the spin. So we go one, two. Is there anything you think about when you get to the end of this? Just anchoring myself for you. Yeah, so how can you tell the difference between a regular whip where I'm just gonna feed that back? It flares out. Flares out, so if you feel a little bit, this is a good thing from the followers. If you find anything that's slightly different from a normal lead, it should uh, cause you to pay attention, right? So if I was leading a basic whip, there's not too much to this, right? You get that feeling all night long in your social dancing, but I'm actually kind of adding a little bit more oomph and a little bit of a flare there, and she feels. And the handhold is different. The handhold, right? Anytime something's different. So from here, leaders, if I just took Miss Megan out of the picture for just a second, as I get to this foot, right, two things I want to do. Number one, I'm going to be spotting Megan. So spotting, I mean my eyes are going to pick Megan up as I'm turning and my head's going to return. So if I was spotting the camera, right, my body would be turning. Everything has left the camera. The last thing to come back are my eyes and my head. That's what we talk about spotting. That's going to help you uh, stay focused and balanced. At least it's going to help stay focused and balanced and not dizzy. Cool? So that's the first thing I want to do is I'm going to have to think about picking up this spot for Megan. The second thing I need to think about is, in an attempt to pick up the spot for Megan, I'm gonna do this wrong. If I do my footwork here and I start to think about the spot and picking up Megan with my eyes, I might not get balanced over that foot. So I have to get good at getting balanced over that foot. And we've got a video uh, directly on that. It's probably in the link in the corner below. The spins uh, are my favorite spins and turns drill. You can also download the ebook and scroll through that and it's got a bunch of videos for that. That'll help. So when I get here onto this foot, right, that's number one, I wanna get up and onto that foot. Then I'm gonna let this leg trail and pick up Me Miss Megan on the spot. Then just like a skater, fun fact, Miss Megan was a competitive ice skater for how many years? 15. 15 years, till she fell on her head, did you fall on your head? Yeah, four staples. Bang, she's tough, right? So I get up here, I leave this flared, and then I'm gonna close this side in to create the energy for the turn. And then he slows it down on an accent, just like a skater, I'm gonna flare that out. Don't laugh at my technique, Miss Megan. Don't <laughs> laugh, I know you're laughing. Well, I'll actually link up a video of Miss Megan skating right now so you know that I'm <laughs> serious, she's legit. Um, I suck. <laughs> so we have boom, boom, I pick up the spot. I have two spins and on the last one I flare the leg to slow myself down and I walk, walk out of it one more time. Pick it up, two spins, a sweep, and we walk, walk out of it into whatever's next. So, hope you enjoyed that. That is a champion's breakdown. We put these videos out once a week where we break down cool moves. Um, if you want those spins resources, uh, the ebook is the easiest way. Download that ebook free, just put in your email address. You can scroll through the spin section and there's bunches of articles, 20 some odd articles. And if we've done a video on that subject, you can uh, download that video free so that we can give you the best uh, resources that we have. 
What else we got going on? We have our Frustration Fridays videos, so make sure you smash the subscribe button in the bottom corner. Those come out on Fridays. And of course, the flagship, westcoastswingonline.com. Head on over there, enter your email, free membership, 25 videos. You can try everything we have to offer for seven days for free. It is really cool. The video player is super upgraded. It's awesome. And we also put out uh, country dance videos once a week, two-step nightclub, cha-cha, East Coast Swing, all those other social dances. So thanks for the support, gang, and we'll see you on a dance floor or an ice skating rink again soon.